My name is Derek Spurlock, principal at Irma Marsh Middle School, home of the Mighty Lions. Our goal is to create young citizens, and to create young citizens, we want them to take pride in what they stand for, so that we are the Lions, is to really take pride and ownership of what it means to be a Lion and what it means to be called a scholar. As an IMMS scholar, I have contributed to my learning community by having an opportunity to go to Applebee's and give out letters to our veterans. During class, we accumulated information and did a research on why we celebrate Veterans Day. I think it's amazing how putting words on a paper can be so meaningful to a person, especially a veteran. I am grateful that I got the chance to go to an event that made my heart bloom. As an IMMS scholar, I have contributed to my learning community by listing notes about what veterans are and what they do for a career. During that time period, my class wrote notes to veterans about how appreciative they were about them serving our country. I got to honor our school by going to Applebee's and giving the letters to veterans. That day was special and very memorable because lots of emotion was going on. I am greatly delighted that I got to be a part of a life-changing moment. My name is Caitlin, and as an IMMS scholar, I have contributed to my learning community by assisting in the creation of an anti-bullying app with the help of my fellow peers in the Superintendent Student Advisory Committee. In this organization, I intend to improve our learning environment here at Irma Marsh Middle School. I have also contributed to my society by representing the Lion Nation at the Fort Worth Regional Science and Engineering Fair at the University of Texas at Arlington. In addition, I am honored to have the opportunity to continue my representation at the Texas State Science Fair in San Antonio. Hello, my name is Mickey McPherson. I teach uh, eighth grade history at Marsh Middle School. Or you can call me King George III, because he has been known to enter my classrooms and uh, harass the students with taxes and, and so forth. Last spring, I also felt like a king when I was named Secondary Teacher of the Year uh, for the district. Because of that award, I also got to go to the Jack Harvey Awards slash luncheon. At Marsh, we are the Lions. Whether it's through academics or sports or fine arts, we always strive to do our best. Lori Farney. I am the coding teacher at Irma Marsh Middle School and uh, coding is a new subject for all of Castleberry ISD this year. We have been able this year to use nothing but open source coding instructional materials that are all available on a website and because of our district's commitment to the 21st century learner our scholars can go home with their school laptops and have access to all of this open source. One of the software programs that we are using now is called Pixar in a Box. They're actually seeing real live animators describe their paths to their careers. Uh, in many cases, we're finding out they weren't math and science and computer people, and they never knew of the careers that were there. So we're able to give our scholars a really broad view of things you can take and do with computers beyond playing a game. goals that we've really targeted is um, working with our ELL and our special education students and we created this goal by looking at the PBMAS data and knew that this was an area that we really needed to target this year. The way that we've done that is that we have allowed teachers to um, do some action research within the PLCs. We found that um, not only has the classroom instruction improved, but this is also, was also a great way to model student-centered instruction for our teachers. We would like to thank the River Oaks uh, community and our parents for entrusting us with your most valuable possession, and that's your child's education. This is a trust that we do not take lightly, and we appreciate you stopping by.